The Flat Nation YouTube game, what it do, man? This your boy Duffy. I already know the vibes, man. We're back with another daily video, man. Hey, look. <laughs> Before we open the video today, man, y'all already know what to do, man. Drop a like on the video right now. Smash the like button right now, man. Let's get this video to 30 likes, please. Let's get 30 likes on this video, y'all. And um, if you're new to the channel, do not forget to hit that subscribe button for your boy, man. We're on the road to the big three thou wow, as always, bro. It's coming quick, man. We're about to hit 2300. I can't thank y'all boys enough, man. I really appreciate the support and love y'all boys have been showing, man. Shout out to the gang. Shout out to the LaFleur Nation, bro. I appreciate y'all so much, bro. Without y'all, bro, I wouldn't be able to get, like, I wouldn't be able to keep doing this, bro. Y'all really, y'all really keep me going, man. But look, um, we're going live on the Twitch tonight, man. Well, yeah, ain't dang. I just noticed. Y'all gonna see this video tomorrow morning. But look, hey, for future weapons, we're unbanned from Twitch now. So, hey, make sure y'all follow the Twitch up and turn the notice on there for the daily streams every single day on the Twitch, bro. The emotes are here, too. So, hey, come get the emotes, man. <laughs> but look, I ain't gonna waste too much more of y'all's time. Let's Yeah, if you're hearing this, man, you got car lacking, man. Make sure you hit that like button and make sure you hit that subscribe button. All right, y'all, we back. As you can see from the thumbnail in the title today, man, I got the best pass first wing in NBA 2K21 today, man. Hey, this build goes crazy, y'all. Trust me. Listen, I don't give y'all nothing but the best builds in this game, bro. And y'all know the vibes with that, bro. Like, look. The build goes crazy. It's tall. It can dribble. It can shoot. It can dunk, man. Play defense, bro. Does it all, bro. And get y'all the Jimmy guy builds. But look, starting out position, man. You rock with the small forward position. Whichever hand you want. We actually got a decent number this time. But look, it's all right. I'm still rocking with that one piece, man. But the skill breakdown, aka the pie chart. You want to rock with the pure playmaking pie chart. Just put that in there. You do get locked take with this pie chart. I ain't gonna lie. Or with this build. With this physical profile stuff, man, you wanna rock with the fastest physical profile. All right, now for these attribute upgrades, man, make sure you copy down exactly what I put here so you can get the best possible outcome for this build. All right, starting out with finishing. Close shot, you wanna max it out. Drive a lip, you wanna max out. Standing dunk, you wanna max out. And then you wanna bring your standing dunk up to a 40. That'll leave you with five finishing badges. For shooting, you wanna max out your mid range, max out your three point. And then max out your free throw at an 83. And that'll leave you with 11 shooting badges. For playmaking, you want to bring your pass accuracy up, up to an 84. And then you want to go ahead and max your ball handle out. And that'll leave you with 28 playmaking badges. For defense, you want to max your interior, your perimeter, your lateral, your steal, your block. You want to um, bring your offensive rebound up to a 38. And then you want to put the rest on your defensive rebound, and that'll leave you with nine defensive badges. So five finishing, 11 shooting, 28 playmaking, and nine defensive badges, bro. Pretty solid build. Really, really solid build. But a body shape, you know we're rocking with Burley off rip, man. If y'all did not know, I'll put that in there for y'all. If y'all did not know, 2K is an animation-based game. So basically, by saying that, I mean you're the bigger you're my player, the bigger an advantage you have. Because look, when you're on offense, you get better blow buys whenever you have a bigger my player compared to like when you play against a smaller player. So you'll blow by them better, which means you'll score the ball. For defense, when you have a bigger my player and you're guarding a smaller player, you get more bumpy. By saying that, I mean in like bump animations, which leads to bump steals. And then, but like, it just overall, bro, bigger my players help, bro. I'm telling you, I'm trying to tell y'all now, bro. Bigger my players help. But Burley, the height, you wanna go 6'8". For the weight, you want to drop the weight all the way down. And then you want to max out your wingspan. Now look, this build is not really... It can be an ISO build, it can, because at 98 overall, you will get the pro dribble moves. You get every single dribble move at 98. But look, this build is mainly for like sitting in the corner shooting, you know, dunking the ball on people fast breaks, playing defense and stuff like that. But look, this build can shoot. I'm trying to tell y'all now. I'm gonna show y'all the stats at 99 right now. At 99, your driving layup will jump up to an 83. Your dunk is going up to a 76. So look, you have all the little pro dunks, you know, like uh, front clutches, tomahawks, those type of things. For layups, you got all the little fancy layup packages, floater specialists, long athletes, Steph Curry, you know, all them type of layups. 
Your mid-range jump shot is a 72 right now. If you have your hot zones and your badges and a good jump shot, you will green all your mid-range shots consistently. As far as a 66 three ball right now, you really have to time, look, the thing this year with Bills that are not supposed to shoot, you really have to time your jump shot perfectly because you're white, your whites are not gonna go in. You're, you have to time your jump shot perfectly. You have to know your jump shot at the back of your hand. You have to have your hot zones and you have to have your bats and you have to have shot boost. So look, I ain't gonna lie, this deal is gonna be hard to shoot on if you do not know your jump shot and you don't have all the little stuff I just said. So make sure you have everything and you'll be able to shoot on this build. Trust me, because I got, I've got i seen it with my own eyes. People green it with 63 balls and all that, bro. You can green with this build. You just have to know all that stuff. But with a 76 mid range at 99, you will not miss. Um, your three ball will jump up to a 70, so that's perfect. You will be greening everything from the corner, trust me. Your ball handling at 99 will jump up to an 81, so that's good. You will have pro drill moves, you'll be able to go crazy with them, speed boost, all that good stuff. Your interior defense is jumping up to a 60. Your perimeter defense is jumping up to a 73. Your lateral quickness is jumping up to a 73. Your steals is jumping up to a 72. Your block is jumping up to a 75, and your defensive rebound will jump up to an 82. Now the speed on this build, the physicals, we're 6'8", 185, right, early. And uh, we got max wingspan. When we think about our physicals on the right, man, we think about plus 8. We think about plus 8. Plus 4 from our Gatorade workout and or if you have gym rent, that's plus 4 right there. And then 99, which is another plus 4, so that's plus 8 in total. So our speed is jumping up to a 94. Our acceleration is jumping up to a 91, our strength is jumping up to a 49, and our vertical is going to jump up to a 73. I'm telling y'all bro, this build is solid bro. With this build we get 4 takeover options, we get playmaking, we get slashing, we get shot creating, and we get lock. Now look, if you want to ISO and go crazy with this build, playmaking is the takeover for you. It is definitely the takeover for you. Slashing is a good takeover, but we do not get contact dunks, unfortunately, on this build, so I feel like it kind of be a waste. Shot creating, another great takeover if you want to fade with this build. And, and every time you get a little bit takeover, it boosts your mid-range shot up, so that'll help out too. Lockdown takeover, I feel like it's a great takeover for this build because this is like, this is not a primary ball handling position or build. So, lockdown takeover would be a great takeover for this build because you're really going to be playing the two with this build. And... You know, you got a PG with you, running floor general, diamond, all that good stuff. And then you got a center with you. So this build is definitely a great build for the two spot. So I'm going to go with lockdown takeover. And there y'all have it, man, the pass first win. Let's go get a build to the 99 real quick. Well, 95, I guess you could say. 95 overall this this is your build as 95 overall not 99 i don't know why 2k does that but it's really your build at 95 if you want to know your true build at 99 is that plus four to all your attributes on the left and then plus eight to your physicals on the right all right for um finishing we got five of them things so we're gonna rock with contact finisher and then relentless finisher on silver you can mix this up and play around one to see which works best for you you can put on relentless finisher or you can put on slithery finisher i definitely probably rock with it. probably both of them. For shooting, we're going to be playing corner mainly with this build. So we're going to rock with corner specialist. Hot zone hunter. Uh, dead eye. And clutch shooter. The dead eye helps a lot for y'all corner sitters. I ain't going to lie, bro. For the corner sitters, make sure you rock dead eye, bro. Because any anytime somebody gets a contest, bro, it hurts your chances of making the shot. It literally lowers your three-point rating when you get a contest. And it lowers your chances of making it, bro. And Deadeye just helps so much with that. So, hey, make sure you rock with Deadeye. You can even take Deadeye down for catch and shoot on like that. You know, whatever your preference is. Even, even rock with it like that, bro. Still a great, great, great setup. Oh, yeah, and just a little FYI. You do not need range of center in the corner because it does not work in the corner. For playmaking, we got 28 of them things. So, we got a quick first step. Handles for days. Unpluckable. Floor General, Dimer, Bellout. Bellout does the same thing it does on Bronze as on Hall of Fame. So that's a, hey, don't need Bellout any higher than that. We rock with Ankle Breaker. And for the last one, we could rock with Stop and Go. Or you could rock with Needle Threader and then put one on Live City Passer. You know, it's really just your play style, you know? For defense, we're gonna rock with Clamps, Intimidator, and Pick Dodger. Now you can run 
pick dodger like this put it on pickpocket interceptor you know whatever you need whatever you're playing really twos threes whatever you're playing bro. don't really matter but if y'all enjoyed this video man make sure y'all let me know down in the comment section below i will be replying to every single one of y'all boys' comments and you know the Twitch is back on band, y'all. So make sure y'all follow the Twitch up. We're going crazy on the Twitch streams, bro. Music going and all that good stuff, bro. But look, it's been your boy Duffy. I'll see y'all boys in my next video on my next stream. I'm going to see y'all boys when I see y'all. I don't know.